Philip Edel from Holochain, and this is the Holochain Identity Manager running on my browser on the left and in a mobile phone simulator on the right. Uh, it's made up of two Holochain applications that we call HAPS. One of them is DeepKey, which allows you to manage your agent keys across multiple devices. And down the bottom here, you can see I've got a key set up for my laptop, which is this browser on the left, and one for my mobile phone, which is the device on the right. The other parts of this are personas which make up your actual personal information. So here you can see I've got some fields like handle, avatar, and full name with actual values in there. And what we're gonna do is create a new persona on the mobile phone, and we'll call this one work. And the reason I'm doing this is I wanna show you how filling out a form from an application is made really, really simple, and you can control which data goes into your forms uh, from the various applications that are asking for this information. So let's do full name here. And in this one, I'm gonna use my more formal full name, which is Philip Beetle. And we'll do create persona. And if we go and look in the personas list on the browser, we've now got the same ones. Now profiles are what applications are asking you for your personal details. So like, you know, a normal registration form. So let's go and look at the profiles. We've got an example one in the identity manager to show you what's going on. And this has some various fields, handle, last name, and first name. And as you saw, we added in to the uh, work and personal personas a, a field called handle. And so it's automatically tried to match the data that was requested in the profile form to what you had existing. So if we select a different persona now, you'll see that my handle changes to a different um, different persona. Uh, I'm just going to switch back to default because I want to show you one of the features where if you add in new data it gets added to that profile. So here's my last name and there was no matching data so that didn't auto complete but when I start typing my first name here you can see that it's automatically matching uh, P that I've typed to existing data in other personas but what I want to do here is add a new field into the default persona so we'll go save profile. And now if we switch back to personas and go and look in default, you'll see that it's added in those two extra fields. Right, really cool. And you'll see that if we go back to the mobile phone and I switch to profiles, it has been filled out with the exact same data that I put into the browser. Now, let's see how that works with an application. So. I'm going to switch to a new tab and we'll go and look at the uh, our peer chat application and the first thing this is going to try and do is look for its own profile and it will discover it doesn't have one and we'll register a new profile with Holochain Identity Manager and here you can see it's got one profile for Holochain peer chat and if we just switch back to here and look in the profiles list you'll see it's added in this new profile and again it's automatically matched the fields that it could find and I think those are all pretty good so we'll do a so profile here and now this is going to take us back to the Holochain peer chat application and use that profile information which it's done here so let's have a look on the mobile and we'll add a new browser window here and we'll go to local host 3003 which is actually a different instance of peer chat uh, as a separate agent on this phone and you can see that it's actually found the same profile that we added into the other one so now we have two different devices acting as separate agents in holochain but behaving in uh, the same as way so that they work the same for for me on both devices so if i say web of trust in here as a room i'll add that on and now I can add some messages in there. And if we go and refresh the list on my browser, here's the Web of Trust list of, or the Web of Trust chat room. So I can say hi from my laptop and post a message. It comes up in here and you can see it's automatically come up straight away in the phone as well. And I can say hi from my mobile and this will show up straight away in the laptop version. And so that's how multiple agents can act as the same if you've got the same profile. Thank you.